Hey guys, how you doing? It's Chris Cole here and I wanted to make a video response and a video update uh, for a split test series that I've been following along with on a different blog and it inspired me to go out and try my own split test. On the other blog, another marketer called Tom Lenz has been running a split test series of videos which I found very informative and helpful and it actually has inspired me now what I've done in this case is I've pretty much replicated uh, what Tom had been doing with one of his split tests and that was actually testing out three different pages. I've done the same and I'm actually very surprised with the results that I've actually got in. I thought my original squeeze page was pretty good. I thought it was converting quite well and I have been running with this squeeze page for some time and when I seen Tom's split test series I thought I would try it out myself. So I went out and set up two radically different pages to my current squeeze page. I placed all three of them into a split test and I went and bought a solo to come into it. Now this is only a small test and it is only early results and I will have more traffic coming into this split test as time progresses. But I just wanted to make a video update to show you the results I have received via my split testing. So if I go into split testing and then split test statistics. And this is the split test I want if I want to build report. Here you can see my split test results and the percentages I have. And this page here was my main page. It's the page I've been running with for some time and the one that I thought was optimized quite well. But if you look at the results that have came in from the split test, it actually was the worst performing page out of them all, which really surprised me. So these other two pages uh, have surprised me quite a bit. Now the only thing that would have common between them is possibly the headline, it's pretty much identical. Other than that the layout of the page and the rest of the copy on the page is different. You can see here they're radically different to the percentages I've got into my main page. And this just goes to show that you can't ever stop testing. You've always got to be keeping an eye on things, running different variants and testing out different things. The page that I thought was converting very well for me actually performed the worst. And here you can see there's quite a drastic difference between my page and my two extra pages that I built from a split test. So that's it for this video. I just wanted to make a video response and update to Tom's series because he inspired me to go out and try my own split test. And I have actually been quite staggered by the results. So I'm going to keep testing. I'm going to keep pushing and tweaking at these pages and I'm going to see just how well I can get these pages converting.